Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2023. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create new composition viewers to make it easy when you are jumping back and forth between different compositions or pre-comps in your After Effects projects. So this is my main composition. I've labeled that main comp. The video inside of the Polaroid frame, that's in a pre-comp, which I've labeled footage. Then all of the background elements, that's in another pre-comp called background. If I want to adjust the video footage, I'll open up the video footage pre-comp. Maybe I want to move this up a little bit. In order for me to see if I like the changes, I need to go back into the main comp. I'll go back into the footage to continue adjusting until I get it the way that I want. Well, there is an easier way, and that is by adding new composition windows. So if I make a change to one composition or pre-comp, I will see the changes updated in the other window. To add a new composition viewer, there's a couple ways you can do so. You can right click or control click in an empty space in your comp window, just go to new viewer, or go up to the top menu, click on view, new viewer. If you go up to the view menu and the new viewer is grayed out, just make sure that you have your comp window selected and then you'll be able to select it. So I'll add a new viewer by right clicking, selecting new viewer. I'll add a third viewer by going up to the view menu and selecting new viewer. I can rearrange the panels. So I'll just click, drag it below the other one, then hover my cursor in between the panels until I see the double arrow and then I can make a little space. To know which comp you are looking at, just look at the very top next to composition will always show the current composition in that viewer. To change which comp or pre-comp you are viewing in each viewer, you can just click on the comp name at the very top. At the bottom, you will see a list of all open comps. So if they're open down here, you will see them in this list. And all you have to do is just select the one and that will change inside each comp window. You can lock or unlock any of the comp viewers by just clicking on the padlock in the top left corner. When a comp viewer is locked, when you select a comp in the layers panel, nothing changes. If you want it to change, just click on the padlock to unlock. And then whenever you select a comp in the layers panel, that viewer is gonna update or change automatically. And if a comp viewer is locked, you can still change the view by clicking on the comp name and selecting from any of the open comps. Having the viewers side by side, I can now just select the viewer, make any changes to the pre-comp, and I will see the changes update in real time on the main comp without having to go back and forth in the layers panel. If you come up with a layout that you really like, you can save it as a workspace, but you wanna first make sure that all the comp viewers are locked, and then you can go to the window menu, workspace, save as new workspace. And to close a viewer, all you have to do is click on the little X in the top left corner. And that is how to add new comp viewers in Adobe After Effects CC 2023. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.